Okay, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to BBG and Tale of Immortal Ground of No Return DLC. We are doing Chaos Mode today, so don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. We got to 10,000, we're over 6,000, well on the way to 7,000. It's exciting times, but I am going to use Jingwei for Chaos. And the reason why is because she's the gatekeeper for the first area in the main game, and I was like, you know what, we're going to make her pass Chaos. So she's a summoner. Max Vitality 50% less effective, but summon unit damage plus 20%, dodge plus 10%. Change your form into a bird, gaining plus 40 dodge that can exceed dodge cap and plus 150 agility. You will be unable to cast skills during it, but the skill will spawn one guardian bird around yourself and every allied summoned unit, dealing damage to enemies touched. So, dodge summon build. That's what we're going to go. We're going to do flowers. To be actually, no, you know what? We're going to do wind. It's going to be wind dodge summon build that's what we're gonna do whether or not it will actually oh god yeah, that's the terrifying it's that's a lot of lightning it's just a bit of snow on nightmare tiny bit of lightning on hell and then just the end of the world on chaos oh i don't know man this is gonna be tough but as long as I have something that kills the mobs without me needing to do anything much, like if I can just do this, I will absolutely be happy about it. Being able to kill the mobs is half of the entire battle. Summon a poisonous plant at a random location. That's probably useful. I'm going to have to do it. It's just going to be a pure summon build with dodge passives. What else? What else can I do? Okay, there's a lot more monsters on the map. That is actually quite terrifying. We're good, we're good. I guess it doesn't help that I have, like, no health. Now, we are absolutely going to go for the dodge destiny. Movement speed plus 10% and increase on dodge plus 33. Every 15 seconds for 5 seconds. That is... Yeah. Perfect, perfect. And it's going to require some serious summon damage, so I'm going to go full dodge. Skill upgrade for poisonous, sure. Summon unit damage, sure. Summon unit duration, sure. I need better skills. I need better skills, this isn't good. I need to be able to summon those plants, that would be ideal. Summon a small flower fairy at a random location and entangle enemies. The problem is that doesn't do damage. Fuck. I just... There we go, primal. Perfect. And an upgrade to windbound, even better. Crit chance, negative 5%, but summon unit damage plus 10%. Done. Worth it. Now we're getting somewhere. Oh, primal level 2, let's go. Poisonous Thorn inflicts plus one damage per stack. Done. Refresh. Surely. Dodge plus three percent. Resistance plus two. Done. This is... It, it just requires a much greater level of build. So I'm not... I'm not not confident for the first two bosses. It's the last two that scare me. They're the ones that just double in health every difficulty. So it might be a slow grind to kill them. Oh my god. But this one was quite nice. Just slaughtered him with <laughs> flowers. Hey, look. If it works, it works. Max flower fairies plus three. Done. Skill damage plus... Yes. Like that. Every 1% dodge will plus 4% wind blade size. I'm going to get that for later. Because eventually I will be using wind blades there. Damage plus three percent might as well. Resistance plus one might as well. Can I please get summon a thorny spirit? I'd honestly prefer to summon a golem if it's possible. Please, thank you. I need I need another skill. All right, I'll be back. I'll see you at ten.
Oh, yeah, man. I don't know. 34,000. Oh, shit. Yeah, probably not. Probably not. I've already died once. Uh, so, there is that. Like, I mean... Oh, fuck. This is a problem. It's freaking chasing me. Oh, my God. Oh my god, no. Oh my god. Oh my god. I don't even understand what's happening. I'm just going to keep running. Oh, I should have got something that... Okay. Problem with this run? No way to regenerate vitality. That's my mistake. I should have known better. That was a foolish move. Oh, some health. Oh my god. Oh my god. Ow! Frankly, it's just unlucky. Please, stop. Stop shooting at me. I beg of you. Oh my god, no. Oh my god. No! No! Dodge, dodge, dodge! Yeah, let's go. Oh my god. Oh my god. Just keep moving. Just keep moving. Please, kill her. Holy fuck. You've got to kill her, guys. You've got to kill her. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh! Okay. <laughs> We're good. Ooh, when there are 10 summoned things on the field, they increase damage by 25%. Yes. And then poisonous level 3. I was hoping rock golems would go up more levels, but let's hope by 14 they've gone up if i even survive till then i'll be back Okay, this is going to be tough. Oh my god, there's two. What? Okay. Alright, yeah. Nah. This is bad. This is super bad. I mean, my healing is decent, but I'm going to be honest with you. Oh my god, why does it have to be a fucking mountain spectre? They are literally the way. Oh my god, no. Oh my god, oh my god. No. Oh my god. Turn into a freaking bird. Run. Run. Oh, this is going to suck. Why? 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 Oh my god. <sighs> okay. 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 Okay, so I figured, what do cultivators use? They use swords, right? So, I decided to make a sword build. Now, I'm pretty sure, pretty sure, I will pass this. Maybe. It is very different to my last build, but it is so much better. Because at least this will actually, you know, kill the elites, which was my problem last time. Look, they're already a third health gone. It's good, okay? 
But now I need to concentrate. Yeah, I'm going to be honest with you, I have no idea if this is going to work. This is tough. You need a perfect build to even just beat 15. And the fucking mobs keep changing, dude. Oh my god. Makes my life harder. That's what it fucking does. Okay. I, and I'm not going to lie, this is probably like my fifth attempt at Chaos level 15 with like five different builds. It's been, it's been a journey. Okay. Oh my god. Look at this. What a joke. Oh no. No, 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 no. We're okay. We're okay. Bro, this is fucked. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, that's like my seventh attempt. Just a 15. Oh my god. Whew! Chaos is... You should get more spirit stones for beating that level alone. Holy fuck. I couldn't even talk through it. That's how intense it was. Water root plus one. Who cares? Stamina recovery. Plus one. Crit multiply plus eight. Yeah, I'll take that. Anything that gives me health. Health recovery plus two. Fuck yes. Skill duration plus 10%. Movement speed plus 50. Let's go. Now I'm going to get every five times inflicting bleed will restore vitality for me because now that I have good vitality restoration it should work well. I ended up going with swords. Seriously, I've tried. I've tried everything. It's fucked. <laughs> it's fucked. And now, really, I'm terrified to see 20. I am. Oh, God. Ooh, all right, I'll be back. Alright, yeah, I'm gonna be honest with you, I don't, I'm terrified, I'm terrified, I really am. Like, I do a lot of damage, this is easily my best build so far, but it just, I'm not sure I'm gonna be able to talk when I get in there, because it's gonna be that hectic. It's, chaos is literally just as hard in the DLC as it is in the main game. Near impossible. It is, oh, okay, alright, good luck to me. This is literally like take 10. Oh, I hope this one's it. I really do. I lag from my build. You'll see. Oh my god. Oh my god. 
Maybe. Maybe. Oh my god. Oh my god. <gasps> yes! <laughs> oh. That was fucked. Okay. That was fucked. Oh my god. Oh, I unlocked the leader of the fiends. Nice one. More artifacts and skill things. Oh my god, that was tough. That was... That was a lot, guys. <laughs> oh my god. That build was absolutely amazing. Like, I mean, pure swords, pure DPS, and literally leech. Vitality restoration. I was basically gaining 16 health per second. Or faster. It was literally the only way to win. I did like seven different versions of this build. And this was the only thing that worked. Oh my god. Oof. Fuck wind. Who needs wind? We got swords. Like real cultivators. Oh, Mr. Leader of the Fiends, where you at? Hello there. Surely your skills are to do with the nether. Upper limit of critical hit rate is 750%, but the repair rate is 25%. So healing? Oh. Negative 75% damage to enemies more than 500 yards away. Jesus. Space bar. Release the nether gas in the body. Consume maximum health per second. Increase critical strike rate by 15%. Increase max health times 0.5 in crit rate. And within the duration of the skill, kill an enemy within 250 to restore 5 health. The skill ends after 10 seconds or when health is lower than 10%. Oh my god, that is a dangerous, dangerous character to play. But it has been done. Boom, look, I got a little stamp, chaos, seal of approval. I'm done. I'm done. I'm out. That was hours. <laughs> that was... I literally put out that community post in between my attempts. No joke. So this is going to be a very late video, but it is what it is, I succeeded. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. I hope you enjoyed this video and my suffering, but eventual success. And as always, have a great day.